there. Welcome to another video. Today is all about my medium size gear kit. This is series two. Here we go. Hey there. Hope you're doing well. Hope you enjoyed series one with my small kit. For series two, the largest difference is in the lighting. As a brand photographer, our shoots can vary from being outdoors or being or being inside a building like a business location. And we need to adjust accordingly. So I have two brand sessions coming up and I want to take this opportunity to show you how I'm packing for those with my medium kit and how I'm making those adjustments. Here we go. Okay, so let's take a look inside. So in my larger kit, I'll have my shoe list. I have the mood board that we created, and that's always good as a reference throughout the shoe. For the camera, my Canon 5D Mark IV is with me. I will have my 70 to 200. This will be great for portraits on this shoot. I will it's always good to have. My 2470 is going to be utilized a lot for additional portraits, the lifestyle images that we're capturing on the shoot. And also on my shoot list, we're doing those classic workspace overhead images. And that is where my 35 prime will come in handy for this photo shoot. In addition, since I'm taking those overhead shots, I have packed my ladder at the bottom of this rolling cart. My lighting, which also fits in this bag, which is ideal. This is, this is the Flashpoint lighting system that I'm using. This is the Explore 600. I love that it, it's wireless, so now I can bring this on location wherever I want. I do have the option this is obviously the battery here. I do have the adapter where it's another battery I could plug into the wall if it's an extended shoot. That would be more for my larger kit, which we'll jump into in series three. But this is gonna be so great for my lifestyle shots that I have for my brand session tomorrow. Um, and then we just break this down so it lays flat and this will now go into that larger Pelican bag. For the flash point system that I'll be using, I also have the adapter. The flash, it's also flash point and it's the R2 Pro. I'll also add this to the list below. But this now provides the controls on my camera. So this will sit on top of the hot shoe on the camera. I'll now be able to control the, the output of the light easily and I won't break that momentum of a great photo shoot and someone's finally feeling comfortable and giving you some great shots, it, I would hate to then say, oh, hold on, let me go walk over to the light, adjust the settings, come back, take another shot. So I found that this has been a very powerful tool to kind of keep that momentum going and make the adjustments that I need for various lighting situations. Now I add this into this protective Pelican, it's the 1050. I've had this since the beginning of my career, and I think there's actually a se second or probably third generation of this kit, this uh, container, but I love that it protects all that key equipment. When it's small like this, you kind of just, do, you don't want it to get lost. You know exactly what it looks like. So I have um, this in that large Pelican bag. So here we go. With the lighting comes all the other lighting equipment that we need. So I'll have my 20 pound sandbag. I have my C-stand. I have the Avenger C-stand. And this is also by Flashpoint. This is their glow. It's the 38 inch softbox that I will put on the light when I'm using the light. As a brand photographer, we're always shooting in different setups and locations. And when I'm shooting indoors, for example, this week I'll be 
on location inside a building. I find that this rock and roller multi-cart has been a huge time saver and time is everything between you as a photographer and also your client. So I can load everything in once, to do the photo shoot, break everything down, roll it out back to my car and I'm good. So I'm on location. We just did our lifestyle shoot with our lighting. So I ended up with this lighting setup for the lifestyle images because this was our prop for the day, this awesome car. And now I just switched to the 2470. I'm gonna take some detailed shots of inside and I kind of need that wider angle. I just did some with the 35. So here we go. Okay, so that is my medium gear kit that I use for my brand photo shoots. Hopefully you found some things helpful, how I kind of manage things and adjust based on the photo shoot at hand. This multi-cart will be ideal for the medium and the large kit when we touch on that in series three, but hopefully you found this helpful. Let me know if there's any questions. Again, all the gear is outlined down below for your research and I'll see you next time. Bye.